hey, need some Mad Ultimate Team coins? Check out your boys' DMs over on Twitter. We got the exclusive deals on PS4 and PS5. If you guys need some coins to improve your Ultimate Team, where you got a theme team or a God Squad, I got the prices for the Lolo. Let me tell you how much I got, right? We can get you a million coins for $40. Where else can you get that deal done? And you won't get banned. What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Texas. And we are back, and we are going to try to do this 4-4 thing once again, man. I keep I keep messing this up. Like, I know what I need to do now, though, right? The last game gave me the blueprint to how to succeed. And if it don't work this time, it just ain't going to work. But the last game we played, man, we played a guy that was really good on offense. Even though I don't think he was that good, he had some really good reads. Obviously, he kept trying to bomb your boy over the top. And then going into that last drive, he got a field goal to win the game. Uh, if you guys have checked the gameplay out, it's really good. Like, it's fun. I enjoyed it. And I hope most games I play in the future are like that because I really had a good time. But he ran the ball on me like crazy. Inside zone, destroyed me. He double teamed my beat of A. And even though Vita Vey is a big dude, takes up a lot of space, he just wasn't able to get off the blocks because of the double team. So we need to go ahead and add another inside stuff. And we went out and picked up the Combine Limited Time. Big Vince Wilfork. Dude's amazing, bro. Love what he brings to the team because now I can get two inside stuffs out here for a total of two AP, which will then allow me to be able to stop the run of inside zone. So if a guy blocks Vita Vey double team, we got this guy here. If a guy double size double team this guy, we got Vita Vey. And in goal line, if a guy wants to run up the middle, we got that. So like I'm I'm looking like we what, what, that balloon came out of nowhere. <laughs> that balloon came out of nowhere. My girlfriend got me, got me this for Valentine's Day. That's cute, right? Yeah. Get your ass back in the closet, bro. Go ahead and show you guys Big Vince Wilfork's ratings. We don't got him powered up, obviously, but if he plays well for us, we'll go ahead and give him to 99 overall. But 82 speed at 6'2", 325 pounds. Just, just going to be crazy. 97 block shit, but like 99 with inside stuff. And then obviously 97 power we out here to stop the quarterback on pass plays. So now that I have him, I got to make a sacrifice with another ability on defense, which is going to be inside stuff on Micah Parsons. Obviously, I didn't use him right because he wasn't shedding it for me out there on the inside run plays, but it just, I thought we could make something happen with him, but it just wasn't. Out my way wasn't working when my Anthony Barr had it. Inside stuff wasn't working, Michael Parsons, so it just makes more sense going to put that on the D tackle and see that actually light up consistently. Just like that, 18 AP all spent on our linebackers in interior line with Acrobat being on Dion because that is needed. Also this game, we're going to go ahead and bench Jeremy Chen in favor of Isaiah Simmons. I haven't really used Simmons or played with them just because when I start getting back into Madden, we got team of the year and then Jeremy Chen got his card. Jeremy Chen is solid, 6'3", 97 speed with 99 zone coverage. The issue is Simmons is just better, right? If he ain't got Cam Chancellor, Isaiah Simmons is the best safety or second best safety in the game behind him because of the fact that he's six foot four, two thirty eight, ninety seven speed, ninety seven man in ninety nine zone coverage with ninety seven hit power. So he's going to be able to hopefully stop the Derrick Henrys of the world from running over me the entire time, as well as that extra height being able to get there and catch interceptions for us. So I think that's going to pay dividends for us. So yeah, we have Dion and Rasul Douglas out there in our cover three. Uh, deep blues with Simmons playing the middle as well as our four linebackers and hopefully we can go ahead and you know do a good enough job and actually win some games so yeah let's go ahead and get into it. You know, on offense first we do got Cam Newton but he's not going to start just because that is for the Panther theme team so let's go ahead and see what we got right now. Ooh 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 I was going to throw it anyway I was going to throw it I think backfield mismatch versus a linebacker let, I don't even know maybe if it's not being user right because he doesn't got outmatched on, uh, he has Lurker. It'll, it'll get picked. It'll get picked. Let's not try that. Let's go, Cooper. Stay in bounds. First down. A little play action. Not us. Oh, okay. That's nice pass interference, but all right. <laughs> we'll take it. We'll take it. That pass interference, he bumped my guy. Yeah. Makes sense. He, he glitched through his body. All right, we should be able to hit Cooper Cup on the outside here if we get time in the pocket. We had Cup. We had Cup there. He just got open a little bit late because his purple was playing deep then came up to play the other guy. Man, my line be kind of just... I might have to go to post like I said last time. There we go. Stay inbound. No! What kind of... They just going to hold me like that? We got that, though. All right, Josh Gordon... Touchdown. He smoked the quarterback right there. Mm, that, was, that was a bad punt. I'm sorry. 
So I got a sub in Simmons, the very next play. Well, let's see what he wants to come out here and run first. My zone drops aren't set, but... Damn it. So two inside studs, and he's still got five yards in inside run play. Okay, okay. Let's see what we got here. Toss. Ah! Come on, guys. <laughs> I would pursue that because you got to, man. You got to force him back inside. Like, in real life, that's what you got to do. Force him back to where your team is. But in Madden, sometimes that can still lead to a huge game. We got a third and seven coming up right now. My curl flats are still set stock. Let's see where he wants to go with the ball here. Oh, I wanted the hit stick there. Good tackle there. Parsons played that way better that time than he has been for me recently. He's usually been kind of... It's because he's not following the guy inside first because there's nobody to follow. Nice throw. Nice throw. He has an edge protection. Yeah, he has one edge protection. I need my Elroy Hirsch to kind of destroy his left tackle over there. That's what I need. Nice throw. Oh, let's go. See, I'll rally for the hit. If I get some hit sticks, I'm cool with those catches. But we're going to get a fumble eventually. Nice stretch. Let's go. See, Simmons out here laying hits. I love it. Chin just not just not big enough, man. 221 pounds. Getting flattened. Nice throw. There we go. Shoot the gap with Simmons, which shows an enforcer, but we'll take the hit stick. He has Josh Allen, so I'm not going to have contains up because if he wants to run out of the pocket, he can definitely do that. I'm going to go hard flat here. Let's go, Luke. Luke! Luke! <laughs> you know what? That's a part of Luke's plan. You know, make it more difficult. Make him run backwards. Don't tackle him. Let him keep doing damage to himself. So I'm going to watch out. The corner route again. I got this route. I got it. There. Oh, what? Okay, cool. Cool. Push him back. Push him back. Push him back. Yeah, look, look at that, man. Bend but don't break. Bend but don't break. We got everything on 30. So he, he shouldn't get any hit zone. Let's go, Luke. Good, my, oh, God. Darren Waller. Weight room. I didn't know who that was. But that was an embarrassing effort right there by our tight end. Let's see what we got here. Let's go, Waller. I'll go back to that. So he's playing a little bit of match coverage. I don't think he set his zones either because... His guys seem to be getting out of position by not just staying on the side of the field they're supposed to stay on. We'll take that. Let's go. Let's go, Debo. Let's go, Debo. <laughs> we, got, we got a little sticky right there. You know, it's a little, it's a little, I'm old. Like, let me celebrate that. My zone drops are still at 30 yards each, which is nutty. So, <laughs> rally for the tackle, guys. Rally for the tackle. Okay. I want the hit stick bad. I want it. I want a fumble. I haven't got a fumble in like six games playing with this defense. Passing the ball here. Let's go. Nice throw. Nice spin. That spin is nuts, man. Oh, what? Whoa. Okay, slide. Nice hit. I wish that was a drop, though. He caught that as soon as he got hit. But playing everything back deep, though, has been kind of beneficial because he's taking underneath stuff and taking these hit sticks. Nice throw. Nice throw. That was the one time playing back too deep cost me because my guy would have been in a position had he been in a regular zone drop. Not getting a sack, but at least he got pressure that last go around. The spin coming? I knew the spin was coming. I knew it was coming. I was just a little too early. All right, let's see what he wants to do here. Pass commit once again. Go blitz loop. That's mine. That's my stay in bounds. Ah! All right, definitely should have scored going into the half, but just a little bit of a, you know, miscommunication from my offensive line. Just not blocking. He thought he might have found some success out of this little set. Oh, I cheated like crazy. I cheated like crazy. Don't call pass interference. Just swallow that whistle. A little shotgun formation. I'm not a fan of it because it's two tight ends. Um, but the old one trap out of it is kind of nice if you know how to run it. Nice throw. A spin. Oh, my. <laughs> spin. <laughs> I know the spin's coming. I got to just be patient. What more can I do, bro? He ran into a hit stick. 
Well, like, like he spun into a hit stick. Like, are you just not gonna fumble the ball? There we go. There we go. <laughs> there we. There we go. Let's go, Simmons. There we go. You know, all is right in the world. our first fumble guys that's our first forced fumble in 4-4 first hopefully not the last that was fun obviously our opponent wasn't like you know the bees knees he wasn't somebody that's out here like you know running comp stuff he probably was just seeing you running stuff he's seen on youtube stuff that he's watching on twitch which no shade to him at all i get that's how he's supposed to learn but he running hurry up taking hit sticks like you can't do both. <laughs> you got to pick your poison, man. You can run hurry up, but your player's going to be tired. If they get hit, they are more likely to fumble the ball than not. So, you know, that's not really somebody that I can kind of base this team being success on. He didn't run much inside zone when he did. I didn't really see much help from Vince Wolfork nor from Isaiah Simmons. But, not Simmons, but uh, Vita Vey. But I will say on that goal line play with those two guys being out there, they did give me a big enough hole to shoot which is, I think, really important to stop these guys running the ball. So I got to get better at my user, and we're going to keep trying that these next few games. So that's going to be the gameplay for this video. Uh, we're going to keep trying 4-4, and we're going to see if these guys can do some damage for us, man. So hope you guys have enjoyed. It's been your boy Tex. If you guys need some Madden Ultimate Team coin on PS4, PS5 only, hit your boy up on Twitter, slide in my DMs. I got the coins for the low low. And while it's not Black History Month, I'm still black. You know, I make history every single day. And I be like... Look, this ain't money came by your happiness, but I swear to God, it's a good down payment. Payment, payment. Trying to stuff so many binges in my pocket, you would swear that I was out here trying to drown Franklin. I was bred in the slums, got fed up with corns, now you don't play a pound cake. Cake, cake, cake. Told me when it was a root of all evil, but I swear to 